Welcome to Bruce's Shorts. My name is Bruce Devlin, I'm the Chief Technical Officer of Amberfin, and today we're going to talk about converting standard definition to high definition in the file domain. It sounds pretty simple really, all you've got to do is make those little pictures in standard definition into the big pictures you need in high definition. And after all, about 80% of the world's TV archives have been shot in standard definition. But when you come to actually do that scaling up of the picture, you discover there's a problem introduced by interlace. So what is interlace? Well, interlace is an analog TV compression system invented back in the 1930s and 1940s. And basically what it means is that every other line of your TV picture of your 25 or 30 frames per second was shot at a slightly different time. And it's the fact that these fields within the frame were shot at slightly different times that gives you the problem when you try to scale the picture up. If there was motion in the scene, you could see that these little purple tracks would be slightly offset compared to the little green tracks. And when you scale them up, those introduce visual artifacts within the TV screen which are difficult to compress in an MPEG transmission system. So to get the best SD to HD conversion, to get good compressible signals for your HD TV or your web delivery, you need great deinterlacing. And it's the quality of the deinterlacer which makes the biggest difference to your SD to HD conversions. Test your deinterlacer, test your up conversion, and look at it on some modern, high brightness, progressive LCD and plasma screens to test how good you've done it. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this Bruce's short. My name's Bruce Devlin. If you've enjoyed it, please tell your friends and colleagues about it. Get them to sign up at amberfin.com forward slash shorts. Or better still, go to our website, ask us a question and find out how we can help you get the best of your file-based workflows.